8 divided by 2 divided by 8 divided by 2. You are welcome. Now, let us solve. 8 divided by 2 is 4. 8 divided by 2, 4. So we now have 4 divided by 4 equals to 1. Even though that sounds convincing, it is not correct. Now, let us solve it correctly now. According to the order of operation, we have to move from left to right in order to do this division. We have to solve this division first before you move to this one, before you move to this last one. If you solve this one before this one, it is not correct. Now, let us go ahead and solve. 8 divided by 2. We have 4. Now, our new expression is 4 divided by 8 divided by 2. 4 divided by 8 can be rewritten as 4 all over 8 divided by the 2 that was there. Now, let's reduce 4 over 8 to its lowest term. 4 divided by 4 is 1 and 8 divided by 4 is 2. Now, we have a new expression. 1 over 2 divided by 2. Now, I like to put 1 under this whole number 2 so that we can have both numerator and denominator. So I'm going to introduce 1 under this 2. So 2 over 1 is the same as 2. I did not change anything there. Here now, we are going to apply KCF. K is for key, C is for change, and F is for flip. So for K, we are going to keep 1 over 2. For C, we are going to change the division sign to multiplication sign. And for flip, we are going to flip 2 over 1. We take 1 to the numerator and bring 2 to the denominator. Now, we have a new expression. 1 over 2 times 1 over 2. 1 times 1 equals to 1. All over, then 2 times 2 equals to 4. So, our final answer is 1 over 4. That is the correct answer. Thank you for watching. Kindly like, share, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Bye.